Hey guys, it's Sid. So I asked you on Twitter if you have any questions for me, and you guys tweeted me, and I told you I'd make a vlog and respond, and that is what I'm doing right now. What is your bra size? Oh, just kidding, because I don't know my bra size at all. And then uh, your serious question was, biggest culture shock as a teenager when you first moved to LA? And I would have to say, uh, people go out here like during weeknights. That was never something people did in Georgia. Um, people are very open here and all different types of religion in Georgia. It's mainly just the Bible Belt. And then um, the third thing was the weather. The weather was, and I felt earthquakes, and that freaked me out because I've never experienced that before. But yeah, that was probably like the biggest culture shock for me. And parking is a bitch. <laughs> it was also another culture shock for me. Kramer Fry, hey Kramer, you're always so sweet. So where are you from and how are you? I'm doing amazing. And I am from Georgia, all over Georgia, Marietta, Dallas. You name it, Fulton County, wherever. We go by counties a lot in Georgia. Captain Sam USA, how does a guy successfully pass a test with flying colors? A guy successfully passes a test with flying colors by being honest. It's really easy. But yeah, I'm not gonna go into being too honest because then you're also shooting yourself in the foot, but it's fine. Uh, the horse's mouth, John on demand said, okay, you asked, what is your greatest fear? Probably never accomplishing any of my dreams, that's probably my greatest fear. That would really suck if I didn't accomplish my dreams. M. Dalma 19 says, as busy as you are, what do you like to do in your spare time? And I like to sleep, watch movies, and research. That's my favorite thing to do on my time off. Gary Offa said, are you embarrassed about having a sister who's a porn star? Ever thought about following her into the industry? That's so creepy. No, I have never thought about following her into that industry ever. I'm not saying that in like a judgmental way. I'm just saying that because that's not what I want to do with my life. I will admit when I first found out what she was doing, I was very embarrassed, mortified, and I don't really follow her work and what she does. I don't really like Google her. I don't want to know. Um, cause that's my sister's business and I love her and I will always be there for her cause she's my sister. But yeah, it can be kind of embarrassing at times, but you know, she's my sister and I love her and you know, that's what she wants to do. So I'm not going to judge her for it. I want her to be happy. Who are your greatest role models and sources of inspiration? I love Robin Williams. That's the first thing that came to my head. I love, love, love him. I really love Zoe Deschanel's career. That also came to mind because she just sold her website for a lot of money and I thought that was really cool. The sources of in inspiration, like my family and all the craziness that happens with my life. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much. Please, please, please subscribe, 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 subscribe.